Hey guys, it's Anita. I'm sorry that I have to whisper, but I'm in a hotel room in Geneva and I'm about to go to the airport to fly to Edinburgh. I've been to Edinburgh in June, so I'll link my other vlogs down below because uh, I did much more than I probably will do now. Um, that's because I'm going to a conference because I'm um, in the Model United Nations Club at my university. I'm UN means we simulate U the UN and yeah that's why we go to conferences i have some free time but it's not that much so i'll try to film as much as i can all right so let's go hey guys so we just had lunch and now we're going to explore Edinburgh. i hope you can hear me yeah it's so beautiful As you can see behind me, we're at the Edinburgh Castle. I went there when I was here in June, so definitely check out my video. Um, but yeah, it's really pretty and yeah, like you definitely need to see that. After walking around for a bit, we went to the National Museum of Scotland. They have a lot of different collections there. You can basically find anything. After that, we went to Victoria Street, which was the inspiration for Diagon Alley in Harry Potter. There are also some Harry Potter related stores and all over the city as well. Hey guys, it's the second day, um, so yeah, so it was really fun. I spent the time with the people that are here with me from my uni, but today I'm kind of trying to explore on my own, so we'll see what I'm gonna do. And we also need to check out of this hotel because the people that organized the conference um, they booked also the hotels and it's in another, it's in another hotel. Anyway, so I'll uh, just take you with me and yeah, let's explore. <laughs> I'm currently in the Prince Street Gardens. It's a bit cloudy today, but it's still really pretty. Let me show you. So that's such a gorgeous fountain and behind it you can see Edinburgh Castle. So pretty. Parliament with um, very interesting architecture and this is Holyrood Palace, the official residence of the Queen. Uh, I'm not going in but I hope you can see how it looks like. So yeah. So I'm not sure how far I'll go but it's really pretty. Everything is so green. Yeah, I love it. Look what I found. So this was St. Anthony's Chapel. And y'all know there are just ruins, <laughs> but it's so pretty. But I don't think I'm going to uh, continue this journey because it would take too much time. Then I went to the National Gallery of Scotland. 
They have some amazing artworks there. Some of them are from international artists, but they also have some from Scottish artists. Alright, so it's the next day and I just went to the Museum of Edinburgh. It's a cute little museum. The entrance is free like most of the museums here in the UK and yeah, it was lovely. And now I'm getting ready for the opening ceremony of my conference. So we went to the opening ceremony of the conference, which is very nice. And we had dinner at the Balmoral Hotel, a really lovely and expensive hotel. The conference officially started the next day. By the way, I was representing Morocco. And in the evening, we had another social event. They booked this club called The Caves. The following day was Sunday, our last day at the conference. Hey guys, so it's the next day. I got home yesterday at 9 p.m. So sorry I didn't update you then, but yeah. Uh, so I had so much fun uh, on this trip. Everyone was super friendly. Okay, some people at the conference were a bit too competitive, but you know, whatever. Uh, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I know it was not your classic travel vlog, but I hope you still <laughs> enjoyed it uh thank you so much for watching it will make my day if you subscribe uh, so yeah see you in my next video bye